Alright, this is my circuit bent Yamaha Porta Sound PSS 130. Made a few modifications here. One of the first things I did was to add this uh, audio jack. You can see this is the speaker, which no longer is inside because I've made room for buttons here. This is a momentary on off switch, normally uh, open. So when you push the button, it closes it and it makes a sound. I'll demonstrate that in a second. Right here is a 10,000 uh, resistance potentiometer. Uh, okay. And right here, special little switch I call the screamer. You'll hear that in a moment. So, right now, here's, here's what the keyboard normally sounds like. Uh, you'll notice I've got the, the jack running to, the, to my, my computer. It's a MacBook running GarageBand, so you'll be able to hear everything coming out of this out of the keyboard without listening to a speaker output. So, that's what it sounds like normally. And uh, I mean, this is a it's just a square wave generating keyboard here. Uh, sounds like a it's kind of like a Nintendo sounding one. Uh, so. Yeah, so it's like. And that's all I know. <laughs> this only has, uh, it's, it's only dual voice polyphony, it's only so you were only gonna get two notes at the same time. So, kind of a crappy keyboard. So decided to change a few things. Here's the screamer. Yeah, so I have really bad keyboard skills, sorry. So let's get to the to this, which is the it's hooked up to there's a capacitor and another capacitor and forgive me I don't know the technical terms, but I I basically hooked them up and I got a nice little oscillator here.
Alright, thanks for watching.